What's up, everybody? This is your boy, Tech G, back with another video to help you successfully pass the CompTIA 220-1001 examination. So let's get into it. In this video, you will learn about common connector types such as the RJ11, the RJ45, RS232, BNC, RG59, RG6, USB, micro USB, mini USB, USB-C, DB9, Lightning, SCSI, eSATA, and Molex. Just connectors all over the place, ladies and gentlemen. Let's talk about the first one, the RJ11. So the RJ11, this is a telephone interface that uses a cable of twisted wire pairs and a modular jack with two, four, or six contacts. RJ11 is the common connector for plugging a telephone into the wall and the headset into the telephone. RJ11 is still a current connector standard. Next, we have the RJ45. The RJ45 connector is an eight pin connection used for ethernet network adapters. The connector resembles the RJ11 connector used for telephones in the US. This connector most commonly connects to the end of a CAT5 cable, which connects between a computer network card and a network device, such as a network router. RJ45 is still a current connector standard. The RS-232 connector. This is a form of a serial data transmission used for connecting computers and its peripheral devices to allow serial data exchanges between them. The RS-232 connector is most commonly found in DB9 or DB15 connections on PCs for printers, mice, and modems. RS-232 connectors have mostly been replaced by USB cables. The RS-232 is considered to be a connector that is in decline. Let's talk about the BNC. So the BNC connector is a miniature quick connect disconnect radio frequency connector used for coaxial cable. After the BNC connector is inserted, it is turned, causing pins in the sockets to be pinched into a locking groove on the plug. The BNC connector is considered to be a legacy connector. The RG59, this connector is a specific type of coaxial cable connector often used for low power video and radio frequency signal connections and produces a characteristic impedance of 75 ohms. RJ59 is often used at baseband video frequencies such as composite video. It may also be used for broadcast frequencies, but its high frequency losses are too high to allow its use over long distances. RG59 is typically used with CCTV. RG59 is considered to be a current connector standard. The RG6 connector is a common type of coaxial connector that is used in a variety of residential and commercial applications and also has a characteristic impedance of 75 ohms. RG6 has a larger copper core than the RG59, which allows for more signal and bandwidth. RG59 is commonly used for providing cable TV and internet provided by a cable provider. RG6 is considered to be a current connector standard. USB. So the universal serial bus, this is an industry standard that establishes specifications for cables, connectors, and protocols for connection, communication, and power supply between computers, peripherals, and other computers. USB is considered to be a current connector standard. Micro USB, this is the smallest of the USB connector types used for connecting compact and mobile devices such as smartphones, MP3 players, GPS devices, photo printers, and digital cameras. Micro USB is considered to be a current connector standard, but will eventually be displaced by the USB-C connector. The mini USB connector can be used with most digital cameras, external hard drives, USB hubs, and other equipment. The mini USB is much smaller than the USB type A and B, but twice as thick as the micro USB. Mini USB is considered to be a legacy connector, but it is still in use. 
Then we have the USB-C connector, and this is an industry standard connector for transmitting both data and power on a single cable. The USB-C connector is easier to connect. It's reversible and has no up or down side to the plug. And with the appropriate adapter, it allows for backwards compatibility to the USB 2.0. USB-C is considered to be a current connector standard. The DB9 connector, this is a nine pin serial connector, once common on PCs that were used for connecting peripherals like mice and keyboards. The DB9 connector can also be used for serial communications to networking equipment and can be used with DB9 to USB adapters to connect to modern PCs without DB9 ports. DB9 is considered to be a legacy connector, but it is still utilized in special circumstances. The Lightning Connector. This is an 8-pin proprietary computer bus and power connector created and designed by Apple. The Lightning Connector was introduced on September 12, 2012 to replace the 30-pin dock connector that was used to connect Apple mobile devices like iPhones, iPads, and iPods. The Lightning Connector is considered to be a current connector standard. The SCSI connector is used to connect computer parts that use a system called SCSI to communicate with each other. SCSI is used for connecting internal hard drives or external devices such as printers, storage, etc. SCSI is considered a legacy connector. ESATA, so ESATA or external SATA, this is a subset of the SATA interface standard. The ESATA connector is used for connecting external storage devices to computers. ESATA cables are thicker than internal SATA cables. ESATA connectors are considered to be a current standard for connectors. And finally, we have the Molex connector, and this is a two-piece pin and socket interconnection that delivers power from a power supply to various drives and motherboard components inside of a PC. The Molex connector is considered a legacy connector, although it is still in use, but it has been replaced by SATA. So let's go ahead and get into some check on learning, shall we? So the first question is, uh, which of the following is not a USB connector type? Is it B, C, S, or micro? So which of the following is not a USB connector type? The correct answer is uh, S. S is not a USB connector type. All right, next question. Which of the following is a proprietary 8-pin power connector for iOS devices? Is it Thunderbolt, DisplayPort, Molex, or Lightning? So which is a proprietary 8-pin power connector for iOS devices? The correct answer is uh, Lightning. Lightning is the proprietary 8-pin connector for iOS devices. And the final question is... Which of the following is a symmetrical reversible USB connector? Is it USB type A, mini USB, USB type B, micro USB, or USB C? So which one is symmetrical and reversible? The correct answer is uh, USB C is the correct answer, ladies and gentlemen. All right. So. In summary, we have talked about RJ11, RJ45, RS232, BNC, RJ, RG59, RG6, USB, micro and mini USB, USB-C, Lightning, SCSI, eSATA, and Molex. Now, if you felt like you have gotten something valuable out of all of this wonderful information, please go ahead and hit the like button, the share button, drop a comment below, but most importantly, hit the subscribe button. Also, go visit my website, Technology G, so that you can get read up on the latest and greatest to help you successfully pass the CompTIA 220 1001 examination. And until next video, ladies and gentlemen, peace.